Welcome to part two of God Eater 3. Today we're going to missions. Yes. I'm going to go to Be careful, I will be careful, okay? Now talk to this guy. Be like, yo, I wanna leave. Let's go. Ah, oh, let's go. Time to get cracking. Let's see if the God Ark repairs worked. Oh, God. We can start off with your shield. Defense is the best defense, but blocking mm. attacks is a nice way to stay alive. Hold on. Yeah, yeah. to choose from. Gotta use what's right for the moment, I guess. Okay, no problem so far. We still got some time, so let's do some scavenging. There's stuff flying around here and there, right? You're picking up winning materials these days. Any spoils we pick up outside of our job don't go to the prison. They're ours to keep. Hmm. If you want to stay alive, you need a stronger god arc, which means you need materials. The port manages god arcs, though, so you can't just do whatever you want with them. Hey, now I... Oh my god, what is it? There is deep when we're going in there. Seriously though, there's a deep. Ah, okay. Okay, that's about it. Looks like your god arc is ready for action. Whoa, origami barging in, huh? Well, that suits me fine. Let's clean up this mess and go home. Well, huh? Yeah. Oh, okay. That's it.
You know. Here you go. Hold on. Wait. Can I log on? Hold on. Hello. Can I go? Hold on. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh, We've got our work cut out for us today. Come with me. Devour form is the God Ark's most distinctive feature. We're off to do a field test of it. God Eaters can devour origami to temporarily enhance our abilities. We call the effect Burst. If you use it wisely, you can flip a dire situation on its head. Hey, there's some luck. Come on, go and take a bite out of that. <laughs> To supply them yourself. And okay, no. on to burst arts. Here's where today's real work begins. Burst arts are techniques that can only be used while you're in burst status. Only ages have the number of oracle cell bonds to perform them. Devour an origami, enter burst status, and then unleash a burst art. Keep that cycle in mind as you fight, okay? Let's do this. <laughs> grow in power but some people say that makes you more origami than human what honestly though in most normal people's eyes we're already monsters okay that's enough for now there are a lot of different burst starts practice them when you've got the time okay go for yeah okay. Looks like everyone's gone to bed. Yep. I hope they can at least have some pleasant dreams to enjoy while they're sleeping. It gets so quiet at night. So, how's the new density level? <laughs> oh. 
Well, I guess knocking origami around is fun when you're in the moment. But if there are still survivors out there, well, then it was worth fighting. It's a small thing, but I don't want to sell my soul and lose my freedom to act according to my own will. I guess it seems kind of funny. We might die tomorrow and leave nothing behind. But I'll keep waiting. Someday, a path towards something new will open for us. An ash storm, huh? <laughs> yeah. Engage. Started. This time, we're testing engage effects. The power of bonds between ages. Engage. Activating engage has a couple requirements. If you're fighting origami and within a certain range, your resonance will deepen. Once your resonance is at a certain level, engage will activate. Anyway, let's try it. share traits. In other words, we can combine strengths. From an origami's point of view, it's cheap. It only works when we're in combat, though, so keep that in mind. Process everyone's characteristics at once would overload a single brain. But we can't know unless we try it either. In any case, engage is the ace up our sleeve. Don't forget we have it. Yep.
Hmm. What? Oh, sorry. It's nothing, really. I'll be fine after I rest a little while. I'm fine now. <laughs> Thanks. Hugo told me not to get up or move around too much. But I don't like just sitting around and being waited on by everyone. <laughs> I just think I should do whatever I can to help. Yeah, we all gotta pace ourselves. Okay. Pretty big.
Hmm. I like. I like. Hmm. We've confirmed reports of increased ash density near Petty Ward. Return to base after collecting tissue samples from Origami in the area. Really thick here. Yeah. Nah, I'm fine for now. This place ain't gonna be our grave. Let's get started. Stay sharp. Busted. Not surprising in ash this thick, I guess. Take what you can and let's go home. Yeah. I want to go home. Good loot again? Ugh, man, there's been nothing recently. That's the price of your behavior. Keep it to yourself. <laughs> well, shall we get going? This is a caravan calling mm -hmm. our agent. What's that? There's an accident to be in the area. It's an attack on Pennywood. An open channel? Who and where is that from? We can't make out what you're saying. What in... Huh? What? Oh my god. That's definitely an ash storm. And it's definitely headed toward our port. Damn it. Talk about some bad timing. There's no way we can outrun it from here. But what about everyone at the port? What'll happen to the kids there? Calm down. We'll manage something. We're not going to stand by and let our friends get wiped out. This is a caravan calling all ages. I repeat, this is a caravan calling all ages. There is an ash storm developing. Ages here. What's the status of the storm? We read you. We'll talk later. For now, we need you to clear out the origami in our path. Why should we do that? I said we'll talk later. Now hurry up and do it. If it's your fee, we'll pay whatever the cost. We don't have time to negotiate. We're on our way to evacuate the port. Every second counts. Understood. Moving out. There are aged children at the port who will need help. You have to get them out of there. I promise you we'll get them out. Good luck out there. Caravan out. I guess this is our chance. Let's go. Come 
Everything changes. Starting now. Yeah. Whoa, that's intimidating. Right. Don't die on me now. We're going to live to see a new future. Everyone will. Ну, вот так, да? Yeah, yeah.
Everyone who is left behind at the port is now under our care. Ricardo's information was spot on. It seems the ages who were left behind were all left inside a room like a prison. There were a number of young kids with them there too. It's awful. How could people have sunk so low? There. I've sent them the rendezvous coordinates. They're planning to meet up there. But are you sure it was a good idea? Offering to pay any price if they clear the way? Probably. They don't strike me as the kind who would trade their lives for cash. Pardon me, but that's... not much of a strategy, ma'am. Huh. I know that. Change heading 180 degrees. Get as far away as we can, now! It's an ash storm! A pleasure to meet all of you. Welcome to our caravan. This is the Ashcrawler Chrysanthemum. I'm her owner, Hilda Enriquez. Hilda. We made it in time, thank goodness. I'm Hugo Pennywart. Handling that origami problem wouldn't have been an easy task, even under the best of circumstances. And that means you're a talented bunch. Would you mind filling all of us in on the situation here? That will come in due time. You've created a real opportunity for us to work with. Won't you let me express our gratitude? You saved our friends. That's enough for me. Yes. However, that is only a temporary measure, as I'm sure you're well aware. Huh? Reassigning ages requires the permission of both the governor of the port and Gleipnir. You do know that, do you not, Hugo? If that's the reason you can't keep us all here, don't worry about it. Being alive is what counts. But do you really have to be so formal? Ma'am, we've completed our survey of the port that was swallowed by the ash. Despite our efforts, we have been unable to establish the whereabouts of the port's management. I'm sure they fled. I saw ships moving away in the distance. Hmm. That would explain it. There were some ships that made unregistered departures. Fools. Leaving without notifying anyone. If the ash storm drags them in... That's what they get for leaving kids to die. Zeke, <laughs> don't. What? You're gonna tell me you're not pissed at him, too? Regardless, it still doesn't make me happy. Ma'am, the ash density levels are rising again. Staying any longer would be hazardous. You now represent your port, Hugo. Under Ashland Navigation Law, I place you under my protection and transfer you to our port. Understood. Our services are yours during the voyage. In exchange, though, we don't want your everyday drudgery tasks. <laughs> You've got a spine. Very well. You can be our front runners and keep our route free from interference. That's fine by us. Once we're out there, you'll see we're not your run of the mill ages. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, yeah. How a caravan route works? 
We use areas of low density as reference points, and then just travel along the connected dots? You've got it down. Just repeating what I learned from the database. There was an old but reliable route through here previously. The beacons, however, have all gone dead. Knocked out by that ash storm. This crawler has a pretty small crew for its size, doesn't it? I can't afford to hire very many people. Resources and bias factor supplies aren't what they used to be. I see. So you decided to bring us on to do a little work for you. Right, and I can assure you you'll be compensated. Yeah, well, a weekly allowance isn't going to cut it. If we can reestablish the old route, we'll be able to claim Pioneer royalties. A cut of those royalties will go to you. Does that sound fair? We're the ones who will be out there risking our necks, so I'd say 70% should go to us. Huh. 30% for us? The rewards are split amongst the entire crew. That's outrageously unfair. Well, what do you think? Let's see. 50%. I can't take any less. I know you've got some serious cargo. You're sure to rake in a hefty profit from that, Hilda. Hilda. <laughs> fine, fine. Half of the royalties. We have a deal. You're free to roam the crawler, though some locations may be restricted. We do have our secrets. Compared to ourselves, it's paradise. Glad to have you all aboard. I'm looking forward to continuing our work together. You too. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Hey guys, I'll see you guys. And the next episode, bye guys.